<laughs> Should we get him to the edge and see if he does it again? Please, come closer! Come closer! Was that teabagging I saw? Woo! This is way more fun than in the trailer. When you- when you pull off these- <laughs> Did I just experience a rage quit? On a beta test. Oh, for Christ's sake. We're launching! This is it! The first launch into Soul Calibur VI. Ladies and gentlemen, feast your eyes on my first attempt at Soul Calibur 6 here on the Twitch stream. But first, let's actually drink this coffee. I can't really tell how it tastes. Uh, by the way, today's controller that we are using is the Razer Panthro. Whoa! It <laughs> just did a DeLorean. This is the old version, but apparently there's a new exciting version of the Razer Pantera coming out called the Razer Pantera Evo. Time to make an awesome character for two hours. No, no, no. We need to get straight into the game as soon as possible. Everybody give love to NM Sniper who showed up yesterday and gifted 12 people subs. It was ridiculous. I bought the deluxe edition, so I have access to Tira. All right, so we're in Soul Calibur 6. Let me tell you why I really like this game over Tekken. You have ultra free movement. And in Tekken, it's kind of not that easy. In Tekken, you've got to like double tap. But in Soul Calibur, as you can see, you just press up, you just press down, you press left, press right. It's like you're running around. But here's something I didn't actually understand about this game. When I was a kid, I thought there were different attacks, but I didn't know that certain attacks beat other attacks. This, your main one, is your horizontal slash. B beats A, A beats kick, kick beats vertical. The attack that you want in this game is vertical because vertical is the strongest and also it beats, it beats horizontal attacks anyway. Yeah! Ring out! Woohoo! Yeah, we're ready to go online, sure. <laughs> That's better. Super combo! Oh my god, he's got a horse? That was intense. Yeah, I don't think there is crossplay. I don't understand why every game doesn't have crossplay. Like, fighting games are already such a niche genre, as it is. Crossplay on fighting games is difficult to pull off. I actually want to know why is it so difficult. I would like a company to explain it quite officially to me. All right, makeshift nuke. How am I enjoying it so far? Loving it. Not loving reversal edge yet, but hey, I've only been playing for like 20 minutes. Search for rooms. Oh wow, you just go by, you don't actually search for names. You actually have to invite players. Okay, that's gonna be a little stressful. Let me just try this ranked match thing first. You know what, I think that because of Reversal Edge and all the mind games that they're talking about in this game, I think if they had put too many characters in at the start, I think it would have hurt the game. Here we go. My first ranked match in the real version. Of I was gonna say Street Fighter. Lara Croft! Let the hype begin! She actually is Lara Croft, that's, imp that's, imp that's amazing. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Yeah. No. It's down to the final battle. It's down to the final battle. Yo, we are breaking records today. We're at 83 now. Let all your friends know that I'm about to win my f my first ever Soul Calibur battle. Get that rage art. Followed by the reversal edge. You ready for the reverse reversal edge? Oh no, it didn't work. Yes. No, it didn't work. No. It's not going as well as I was expecting. That's fine. <laughs> What actually happened is I I did a Ginyu, I swapped bodies, and what, I, what actually happened is I just won that battle as Lara. That was a... Uh... Hey, we got the rematch. You ain't gonna know what happened. 
I have to remember at least one move. She's gonna rage quit. They're gonna rage quit, because I'm gonna keep doing that. They're gonna rage quit. <laughs> this is working. No! <laughs> no! Shut up. I mean, don't shut up. Yeah, I know, I deserve that. <laughs> I honestly thought that was gonna work. <laughs> awesome, another person with zero points. Oh man, is this game gonna be costumes all day long? I do not want to play against people's custom characters. It's confusing! If they don't look like Mitsurugi, how are you gonna know what moves they can do? Oh man, I'm not into this. I'm gonna play arcade mode, where people use the correct costumes. Quick! Help! Help me! Yes! Finally. Quick, I need more advice. How do I keep this up? I love the control scheme, I'm gonna be honest. I like that this, I think the control scheme works really well. I'm not sure, I feel like in the original game, weren't there like two different throws? In Soul Calibur 1, you could like do throw one or throw two, but I quite like how there's just throw, reversal edge, super, and break attack. I want to know your opinion on the fact that this game has custom characters. Do you think that's better? Do you think it's better to have custom characters like this where on in an online ranked mode when points are on the line? Like you finally figured out who these, I don't know how many characters there are, 20, 25? There's a lot of characters. I think as a beginner you'd be like, oh, Nightmare. I know Nightmare has this funny move that they do. But if they look like Lara Croft, I think it's a bit confusing for beginners. It'll be fine for pros. The pros are not going to have a problem with it. Like, I don't mind costumes so much as just, like, completely changing the look of a character. Like, you could have a really big-bodied character. Like, in Street Fighter, graphics really matter. Because when you see a big-bodied character, it's kind of a sign that they're going to move a little more slowly, right? And that changes the way you play the game. But in this game, you can have, like, a massive character moving really quickly. W-F-T. The Wii Fit Trainer. <laughs> That's funny. That's genius. How did they get a t-shirt that says Wii Fit? Can you write anything you want on the t-shirt? What character are they? I don't even know. Inferno? Oh, it's that magician character. See, stuff like this. You won't know until halfway through the, halfway through the match who you're actually fighting. I don't know what's going on anymore. I don't know who my enemy is. I don't know what they can do. This is all very new to me. Okay, let me learn Let me learn a combo. Let me learn one combo. And then we're gonna go online and we're gonna use that same combo over and over and over. Yo, Dingo! Thank you very much. I was beginning to feel a bit pissed off by this. But it's a new game. There's no need to get pissed off. It's a new game. The main attraction is custom character customization. No! All right, show me some of these moves then. Xianghua. I don't want to read. This style excels at close range combat. At the start of a fight, use moves like playful rhythm. This tutorial mode is, is really awful. I really don't like this tutorial mode. <laughs> I really, really don't like this. Currently, points for gameplay, 10. Points for tutorial mode, nil. This is awful, this tutorial, isn't it? Fragrant Dream. So let's see what this fragrant dream looks like. This is the worst tutorial of all time. It should You should press a button within the tutorial, which is a shortcut to the move that they're telling you to use. I've already forgotten what the name of the move is. What was it called? I have no idea what I'm looking for. What, what, what am I looking for? Oh, for Pete's sake. So this is standard middle middle. In high low. This is interesting. I feel like I'm actually learning the game now. So we've got the basics. I think we're ready to go back online. 
No. This is good. I feel like I, I understand a bit more about what's going on. Beat it. Blocking with a button felt terrible when I played the beta. I was like, wow, you have to hold down block? That sucks. But now now it makes total sense. Because it because it's it's a 3D fighter. The point is to move around. And so to block with a button makes way more sense than holding back. Because if you had to hold back, you wouldn't be able to move. It's okay. This time we're gonna win. As long as they don't evolve and learn. Perfect! Back on form, guys. We're back on form. Someone's pissed. That was a good parry. Yeah! Three in a row! We're back. We're back, baby. I don't like the way that she's shaking that sword. Alright, now to find out who the true victor was. The Namco Twitch. Is that a thing? I've not heard of it before. Dingo, yo! It's happening, boys and girls. Kimi nara dekiru Thanks, Dingo. I appreciate the encouragement. No, that should have worked. Oh no, I should have done back B B B B B B B B. Haven't done a one of them in for a little while. Kimi nara dekiru. Uh oh, downloaded. No. Please be enough. Yes! We're back! I'm back! Ow, monkey! Thanks for the follow! I'm really loving that you guys have joined me for my first ever play of the release version of Soul Calibur 6. I'm having so much fun. Oh well, I'll, I'll focus on that later. Hey, I was busy. Wow. 
Wow. Chill. I was busy. All right, new type. Thanks for the, thanks for the bits for the win. Here we go. Oh, I, <laughs> I pressed the wrong direction. I actually got myself closer to the edge. I was trying to move away from the edge. The low kick. Watcha! The watcha! I saw that all happening in slow motion. That sucked. Just came here from your YouTube video with Goose. All right, grouchy dude, how's it going? Thanks for watching the video. We're gonna teach this guy a lesson. <laughs> that that lasted a long time. Time for the run back. It's time to win the run back. All right, got this. It's all happening. All right, and Juna Papa, thanks for the follow. Moe Moe Beam. I'm not really sure what move that is, but it sounds good. <laughs> On that note. Well, I, I guess I guess we get a rematch after that, but. <laughs> uh... <laughs> no sweeter taste than victory, especially when the en when the enemy kills themselves. <laughs> that feels good. I didn't know it was gonna feel so good to, for that to happen, but that felt good. Okay. This is this is where we. This is where we decide the real, the true victor. Should we get him to the edge and see if he does it again? Please, come closer! Come closer!
Woo! Ah. All right, Andrew Papa, love your YouTube content. Thank you very much. And I got a trophy. Here we go. I don't know why this move doesn't always do what I think it's going to do. See, all I needed was a couple matches to, to download. Nothing like a super finish! <laughs> Nothing like a super finish! That's how it's done! Secretly, I'm a 3D fighter. I had no idea. That was confidence boosting. I got loads of points now. Yo, the Blade Child! Thank you for the bits! This game is so awesome. How good is this game? Has anyone else shown you this yet? I don't know how to zoom in. In any case, there is some epic cool artwork in the museum mode. So I will definitely be checking out all sorts of stuff. It looks like there's museum stuff to check out, training mode stuff to check out. I'm I'm keen on trying this whole mission mode thing. Anyway, that's, that's all for today. Oh, the Senpai video? <laughs> that was a great stream. Definitely, if you didn't get to check out the, the dating sim stream, the VOD for that is good fun. It's also quite educational. I'll be doing the dating sims probably once a week, and the rest of the time I'll be doing probably Soul Calibur or Cross Tag, who knows? I might even get back into Dragon Ball Fighters. I am 100% definitely playing more Soul Calibur 6 on stream. We are definitely making a character, and I'm definitely going to learn a bit more about the systems. I think I think it could be really good fun to, to level up in this game and really learn how, how to play. I don't know if I'm going to go to tournaments for it, but I definitely want to have a go at being good at this on, on ranked mode. See you all next time. Bye!